After Cassandra Perkins was shot Saturday morning, it was Cheryl Shepard who frantically called 911 for help. Cynthia Newsom is here with more on that call. Well, the call is at times unnerving and extremely heartbreaking. When Cheryl Shepard told the operator Cassandra was still alive moments after the shooting, you can hear baby Zoe crying in the background. Are you with the, are you with the patient now? Oh, yes, the baby's crying. Yes. Okay. Is it a, is, okay, we're on the way. We've been on the way the whole time. How old is the patient? 22. A male or female? Female. And uh, is he breathing? She's still yeah. breathing, but barely. Please hurry. I don't okay. know how many times he's got her. They were arguing. Oh. Okay, so she's been shot? No. Okay, right now is she awake? Yes, stay with me. The she... ambulance is on the way. You hear me? You hear me? Cassandra! Hey! Stay with me! Okay, listen, ma'am. Is she awake? She's barely. She's just barely. Can you hear what you're saying? Yes, she's moving when I talk to her. Okay. Oh, God. Is she bleeding? Yes, she is. Where is she bleeding from? I can't tell in the back, it looks like. Okay, well, we don't want... Go ahead. Go ahead, Petey. Where is your son at? Yes. Huh? Look, please, just get this family up here, please. We're on the way. Where is your son at? Yes. He left? Yes. Okay. They were arguing and he yes. shot her? Yes, they was arguing. Wow, an extremely emotional phone call. Minutes later, police received a second 911 call. By the time they approached Belcher at Arrowhead, he had already taken his own life. In the newsroom, Cynthia Newsom, 41 Action News.